We've really fallen in love with this area. Yeah, we love it. Yeah. We'd have never thought to come here for a beach holiday. This is our breakfast stop this morning, Island Donuts. We just come over dark yeah. and really foggy. It's been so nice here on the river. Good morning. <clears throat> Good morning. We're up for the sunrise this morning. Yeah, it's about half past six. We're gonna walk along the beach, go and get coffee. It's just so beautiful. It is. It's I can't get over it. It really is, yeah. isn't it? Um, so yeah, we're gonna go and grab coffee. Girl, you go. Won't you miss the ones you know? I'll be here, hanging on, waiting for your call. Seems like time. Our hotel, and um, we're gonna make a left and um, walk towards the pier towards coffee. Something that we just wanted to let you know about St. Augustine because it's slightly north of Orlando, it is a bit cooler. We've been noticing, we were watching the weather app, weren't we? The it's like an extended weather, it's only the one I use on my Apple phone, my iPhone. Um, so it's not like some fancy app looking at the 10 day forecast so that you can kind of plan your trips and St Augustine is typically about five degrees or so cooler than Orlando which doesn't sound a lot but if it's only about 20 degrees that is a lot isn't it it is and we've mm. noticed it in the evenings it's still what was it? it must have been about 18 degrees 19 degrees last, last night, night yeah but it does feel a little bit chilly yeah um, we all had jackets on i had a blanket over myself and we sat by the fire as well and it was chilly i've got jeans on at the moment we're going out on a ghost hunting tour tonight and i'm definitely gonna be wearing jeans and a sweatshirt are you wearing full length? They recommend you wear full length trousers anyway. Uh, I'm just going to wear my shorts, but I'm going to take a zip up top with me. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be so. quite cool. But yeah. the same way goes as well. If you're going further south, keep an eye on the temperature because it's quite a bit warmer than Orlando as well. Like when we were looking at planning our Keys trip, it's quite nice this time of year when it's a bit, if you have cooler days in Orlando, it's a lot warmer down in the Keys. Yeah, I, th I think also in the evening, although 18, 19 sounds warm, mm. anyone that's been here as well, when it's been hot during the day, that does get to feel a little bit chilly. So it's yeah. nice, it's nice. So, but uh, yeah, just it's being prepared. And it does change. Where will you go? Won't you miss the ones you know? I'll be here. We're just gonna stand here. We're hoping it starts rising from above the cloud. It's a little bit cloudier today. You can actually see sort of over the pier there. It's really a bit foggy. There's lots of people though. When I say lots, it's obviously not crowded. You can see more like around down there by the hotels. Everyone's sort of come out to wait for the sun to rise. And as always as well, I find when you're in the States, everyone's really chatty and like everyone says good morning and you get in the lift, don't you? And you start talking to people and everyone wants to, like in the dog park yesterday, everyone wants to know where you're from and Nine times out of ten, they've been to London. <laughs> you hear their stories. I really like that. I love chatting with people. I 
think it's time for coffee. This place is right off the beach and they do breakfast as well from nine o'clock. It looks really quite nice. I love all the colours. Oh, it's open. Stir it up. 9am till 6pm. There's burritos by the looks. Sandwiches. I like the post boxes. What is it about the post boxes? I guess it's because we don't have that kind of thing in the UK. I like the look of this place. I think it looks really cool. And it's right off the beach as well. And this is the road then. And we're going to get our coffee again. It was so good yesterday, wasn't it? We're going back to Kookaburras. So, if you like tacos, the taco shop here yesterday, every time we drove past, no matter whether it was the morning, after it had opened, lunchtime, we were there in the afternoon and in the evening, it was full the whole time. So it must be very good and obviously very popular. Oh, there's the opening times there. Aid's just spotted as well. Friday and Saturday, it's open from 11 a.m. till 2.30 in the morning. It looks really yeah. fun, but seeing it, all the lights on and everyone sat out there, it was the kind of place that made you want to go. Yeah, it must be something good. It must be good. Should we have a look at the menu, actually? <clears throat> there is something about when a place is full that you think, yeah, I want to go there, I want to be part of that. This is the type of food I love. See, burrito stuffed with rice and your choice of black or pinto beans. They do bowls, tacos, quesadillas. Loads and there's loads of sides as well. I think it looks really fun. Oh, that sounds nice. World famous Mexican UFO. It's chewy, crunchy, cheesy. So full of flavor, it's out of this world. Here we are. Aid's really wanting a t-shirt as well. He, um, we tried to get one in St. Augustine yesterday. We popped in one of the little stores there, but they didn't have any in his size. So we're gonna have another look Thank here you. today because we didn't look properly yesterday. Could even sit out here for coffee, couldn't we? Uh, I think it's that's supposed to be nine o'clock. It's all it been wiped like off, hasn't it? Yesterday we went for the smaller ones and we regretted it because the coffee was so good. So we've gone large today. We're just going to sit, because it's early in the morning, the seats are a bit damp. So we're going to sit on the wood here. We've got some really lovely succulents. And we're going to share the lemon berry loaf. Right, we've never seen this anywhere else in the world. And we saw people using them yesterday. You take a flag, look left and right, and then walk across the road and put it in the other side just for added visibility. I actually, Aid wanted to do it and I thought it said for the disabilities. <laughs> it's definitely hazier this morning. It's still really beautiful. Just walking back along the beach. We just got chatting. Um, sorry? Just yeah. still. We just got chatting to a really lovely couple. Originally from India and they've lived in Long Beach, wasn't it? Well, Long Island. Long Island, Long Island sorry. Island, I always York, get the mother so yeah. up. They were so nice and the, similar to us, older teens and that. It's really nice chatting with them. Um, that's something I love being on holiday. Yeah. We've just chatted to so many really interesting people. It's been so nice. Um, we were going to say about the coffee, weren't we? Yeah, the coffee grabbed at uh, the Kookaburra. I think it has to be the best we've we've had. The best coffee we've ever had. So we went for the large ones today. We taste go just for the large same. And that sounds tomorrow. daft, but sometimes you can go somewhere. Yeah. You get a larger one, it's not quite the right strength, or it this tastes different. Smaller one can be too strong. But this is just nice, it's so smooth, it's almost creamy as well. We always have whole milk in ours. Mm. Um, but this is just so nice, so it's so tasty. Perfect, really the good. The coffee and is to the taste of it. It's just so nice. And that lemon berry loaf was oh. amazing. And the reason we shared 
is because we've got our eye on a donut place, which we're hoping to go yes. to in a bit. Yes, so it's only open till one o'clock, so we need yeah. to make sure we don't miss, and it can get busy. So that's Island Donuts. So we hope to get there today. Not quite sure what else we've got planned. We are going out for dinner later. Um, we're going out, it's my stepmum's best friend. She's um, just a few doors along at a different resort. She comes and spends the whole of winter here every year. And they've been friends since they were 13. It's really sweet. So she wants to meet us and she's got a puppy Shih Tzu. So we're looking forward to meeting the puppy, aren't we? Yep, and we're gonna have some, uh, well, it's probably an early dinner really, isn't it? Yeah, I think we've got a table reservation for four or something like that. And it looks beautiful right on the waterfront, isn't it? It's a it seafood place. Um, yeah, we're really excited about eating there. And then tonight, We've got a ghost tours um, booking, haven't we? Yeah, in St. Augustine. Yeah, so I think we're going to do that in a separate video. But today it's going to be very chilled and I think all about the food. Just heading back to the hotel. It's just after eight. We were saying, weren't we, how we've really fallen in love with this area. Yeah, we love it. Yeah. We'd have never thought to come here for a beach holiday. No, and it's got a real mix as well because it's got the beach, it's got the quiet. But it's got you can, the town. You've got the town, but you can walk, get coffee. There's choices. Yeah. So you can do as much or as little as you like as well. You have got your chains as well, not that we're here for those, but you've got a supermarket, you've got a Publix nearby. So it's kind of almost like perfect mix yeah. of everything, isn't it? Yeah, and only two hours from Orlando. Yeah, I'd definitely, definitely come back here again. Me too. That's our hotel. Dad and Janet are just getting up and ready. Dad's walking the dog. I think we're going to head out with them. This is our breakfast stop this morning, Island Donuts. Found this place on YouTube. And there's one in Anna Maria Island as well, but they close at once, we missed it before. Oh, it looks so cool. Now to decide. Well, I'm, you can try some of my pineapple fritter, okay. and then you choose your own. I'm really impressed with the selection here. So I've gone for pineapple fritter. <laughs> And I've right, got the last the salted caramel. Hold your fingers and let taste the salted caramel. And you got so a t-shirt, nice. didn't you? Yep. So I've got it's going to be sticky now. And at a 10, I would give um, Island Donuts. Back at the doggy park. It's really pretty. With great big trees with hanging Spanish moss. Have to say, they could possibly have been the best donuts we've ever eaten. They were lovely really really good they were quite similar to joffrey's donuts in disney but a little bit softer would yeah, you say a bit yeah. gooier really really good my salted caramel was really really nice it was really sweet um i think that mix of i'm really loving that salted mm. mix with the sweet kind of thing definitely because you've been making some pretzel yeah. treats haven't you so i think i really really like that got kind of into flavor. that mix so that was lovely i think i'd like to try something different another time I think because you just want to, if we do go back, you just want to try some different things. Your fritter was lovely. Really good. Hey, are you just tucking into the cheese balls? Yep. Um, Ollie got a new coat, got a new raincoat. Oh, is this your t-shirt? What's my t-shirt? Aid got a new t-shirt this morning. Island Donuts. It's a nice one, I like that. Um, and we're going to head down to the beach now. We've just got our swimming stuff on and we're going to go and chill out on the beach for a bit. Right, so later in the afternoon, oh, we had showers and again, because we've been on the beach, it was really blowy. Um, just been relaxing a bit, it's been really nice. The weather has been really weird. So we were out this morning, it was lovely and sunny. Sorry, my hair's getting stuck in my lip gloss. And then we were gonna spend some time on the beach and we were just sat here on this deck. There's like a decking area that you walk there from the swimming pool and then onto the beach. And Dad was saying about the vlog the fog coming over and we could just watch it almost like a cloud of fog and suddenly we were in the fog and you could see the fog it was almost like smoke around us and we couldn't really see the beach it was so weird so we wandered down to the beach but we couldn't really see anything and like the ho um, hotel was in fog um, we did I didn't have my camera on me because we were just gonna have a bit of downtime but Aid caught some with his phone so I will include that because it was really weird and it got quite chilly as well and really dark and then we ended up going back upstairs um, got showered and sorted and then we've just come out and it's beautiful blue skies again not sure how well you're gonna hear us it's really a bit windy it's come over really bizarre I'm just gonna turn the camera around but it's coming 
like really cloudy. It's blowing in from the sea. So I was going to turn the camera around. But you have a look. Can't see, there's no cloud. Sun's still out, blue sky. It's almost like foggy. Yeah, if you see, look, it's just blowing in. It's weird. skies it's warm it's still a little bit blowy it's just really weird we couldn't see even the grass here before we couldn't see over there where the other decking is it was really weird wasn't it it's was really strange yeah, yeah it's just like, really eerie sea. yeah so this evening we're going to a place called Aunt Kate um, it's about half an hour away from where we are it's on some water by the looks um, recommended, um, Janet, my stepmom's been there and we're going with her best friend. I think I mentioned this earlier, they've been friends since they were like 13. And she's in the next sort of like, resort along and we're joining them. I don't know how much I'm going to film because I just feel a bit funny getting my camera out. So I think we'll get our phones out and just share our food and I'm really hoping that the, the views on the website look beautiful. So obviously I'll share that with you and then later when we start a new vlog, we're going ghost hunting, which I don't know if I'm excited or nervous about the ghost hunting. Don't know what to expect. Yeah, I think I feel a bit nervous <laughs> actually. Not nervous of the ghosts, but I don't know what to expect. Yeah, it's just the unknown, I think. Yeah, it's, uh, we don't, don't quite know if we're what we're doing, if we're being taken round or... Yeah. No, it's... How long is it supposed to go on for? Two hours. Hmm. Yeah, um, what are you fancying for dinner? I don't know. Part of me is thinking I fancy a burger. But yeah. being by the sea and there being this being the, it's actually a seafood restaurant, isn't it? Yeah, it's a seafood place. I kind of feel it's wrong having Sorry. something like a have something like a burger. So it's a little bit blowy, so hopefully you can pick this up and it's not too windy. Um, but no, I might go for something fish or seafood maybe. I'm thinking the same. The empty theatre. Oh, see that in April. That's where... Yeah, it's where Beach Boys are going to be. It's cool, isn't it? They seem to have some good bands there. Yeah. There's the lighthouse up in front. here almost like Bates Motel-esque there's this one here as well <coughs> don't you think yeah it is really yeah. like that I've noticed quite a few along here just going over the bridge this takes you to downtown um, St Augustine Turn very right onto May very pretty Story, coastal byway Avenida Menendez and from here we're about 13 minutes from the restaurant See the boats in the water. Oh, the tequila place looks nice there. I love the buildings. Ripley's, believe it or not, museum. The very first Ripley's, that one is. This is 
the trolley tours there. I'm looking to see. Didn't actually. I think the trolley tours we did was on the left there. I think that's where that was. What, just here? It's around here, yeah, unless oh, they've there, changed there, it. Oh, have you seen it? Is that the one? Oh no, maybe not. Is that it? Was... It? it was on the side, I thought. That's no, normally it's a coffee place. There's the Fountain of Youth. I've read about that place there. The trolley tours all come around here as well if you do them, they all sort of stop around here. Oh, there's one there. I like the sound of them. You know when you hear the person doing the talking? Mm. In 300 yards, turn right. Oh, well, there's the fountain of youth. There we go. Old town jail. Do you remember we went past yeah, all that um, before as well? I think we're going to go up on this bridge, aren't we? Going over some more. Wow, it looks quite tall. Yeah, <laughs> wonder if you'll see a dolphin again. That's so cool, isn't it? Yeah. Oh wow, they're walking it. Really pretty. And then we're making a left. They look so nice. They've all got like boat docks on the end. Quite a lot of them are raised actually out of the water. So, um, I wonder if, because it's the marina, I wonder if that's why. Food place down there. You can see it's funny seeing the ocean then over there as well. Continue on A1, a scenic and historic coastal. That's impressive looking over the beach. That's so cool. I guess we've got, is that, I guess you've got water both sides here actually, haven't you? So it's the beach on the right. Yeah. You've got land the other side of it a little bit as well. Yeah, so. it's really weird. Yeah, the beachfront's actually on the right hand side, but there is water on the left as well. Well, well obviously, because we've just come over the bridge, haven't we? Ah, here we go. Here's the beach here. Right there. Oh my goodness, look at the view they've got. These ones are being built. There's lots of new builds going up everywhere, I've noticed. Oh my goodness, look at the stilts. Again, that's to stop the void of yeah, stones, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Wow, and you've got the, so they don't have to cross the road. Welcome to North Beach. We're going to be making a left soon. That's where the restaurant is. It's quite nice over here, isn't it? It feels very beachy, doesn't it? Yeah, but it feels nice. Yeah, really nice. It's very island life, it feels like. Yeah. So I imagine this possibly being a bit like how the Keys is. Okay. That's how I imagine it. Yeah. So, yeah, I can see I what you mean actually. I don't know if anyone who's, who's watching has been to the Keys. Is this kind of like... Does what? this remind yeah. you? Because I imagine that being like a road going through from all yeah. the Google Maps and yeah. vlogs. And That's you've got true. your properties kind of almost like either sides. There's a thin strip of land. Yeah, I can see what you mean. And you drive in and you might drive down a little bit further to get to the next property. It's kind of little bits. It's all the colours the as well. I love all the colours of the property. They they're right literally on the beach, these ones. So really, I love how all the properties over here are always so different as well, compared to at home, where everything looks the same. And we're going to Aunt Kate's. Oh, well, this looks cool, In doesn't it? Mile, your destination will be on the right. They've all gone ahead, um, just in case we overran with dinner or anything, because we've got our reservation. Is that a bird in the road? Yeah, or a... Mm. Um, just because we've got a reservation, we've got to be in St Augustine for half eight. So just in case we're running late, we've got our own car and then we don't need to worry about anything. Here it is. Yeah, I guess you can park anywhere here, can't you? Yeah. Well, it actually okay. is on the river. There's a big pelican over there. This is so nice here on the river. Uh, can you share Which this ones? Yeah, I'll share yours. Minimal. There's it's enough really for each. Oh no, we'll give it a go. There might be a...
That was such a good meal, wasn't it? Yeah, that was that was really really nice. Yeah, so we're on uh, the Tolomato River, and the place is called yeah. Aunt Kate's. The fish was delicious. So Dad and Janet, Janet had a fish called Sheep's Head. Never heard of it before. It was catch of the day. Your dad had blackened, didn't he? Blackened. It was very tasty. I tried it some. It was so nice. I tried a bit as well. Yeah, oh, did I you would as have well. possibly gone for that actually. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> it was just a white fish, but it was really really tasty, wasn't yeah. it? And I had the mahi mahi tacos, which were amazing with black beans and rice. Really really nice flavour. Really seasoned well. Mm, yeah, your dad and Janet's uh, friends. He had a burger, and what did um... she have? She had the <coughs> sheep's head as well, didn't she? I think so, yeah, yeah. but was that as a Sam? Catch of the Day or Yeah, something. Catch of the Day. So, know. yeah, I went for the calamari. Yeah, I went for two appetizers, calamari and I had the fried green tomatoes. We had those as a side mm. at Lookout Mountain in Chattanooga. Chattanooga. Um, and I loved them, and it's something we don't get at home. I mean, I guess we could try and recreate them, but yeah, we could do it. it's just something I really fancy to add that and just some fries. So it was really, really nice. Really calamari was lovely, food. seasoned, not tough. Just perfect. And the whole lot with tip for our two came to sixty dollars. You pointed out to me that my beer cost two dollars fifty. Two dollars fifty. You had a, it was a pint as well, yeah. wasn't it? And my Coke was. I know you get refills, but my Coke was three nineteen. My beer was cheap. Yeah, you see, your beer was cheaper than my yeah. Coke. It was such a good meal. I would definitely recommend this place if you're near Saint Augustine. It's so beautiful on the water. Now we obviously didn't know about this. It was a place that that um, your dad and Janet have been before. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I guess if we'd have researched places, we may have come across it, but I, I don't know, would we? I don't know, it's just tucked away, it's it so nice. It is tucked away, but it's so nice. But it just goes to there's show that there can be, you, there's so many things out there you can yeah. try. But no, we really recommend yeah, it, it's definitely. really nice. Yeah, aunt, anyway, aunt Kate's. we're off to go ghost hunting and we're gonna start that in a new video. So we're yep. gonna finish today. Today has been, whoops, such a relaxing day. It? Yeah, it's, it's that kind of day really where nice. you think about it, we haven't done a great Just deal, eaten. but we've really enjoyed what we have kind of have mm. done it's relaxing. Been, I was going to say lots of relaxing and lots of chatting. Walking. It's just been, it's a, eating. been a nice day, really yeah. nice day, but we hope you've enjoyed hanging out with us. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next video, Ghost Hunting. Yes. Take care. Take care. Bye. Bye. So we're looking forward to this. Yeah, I feel really nervous though. This is where we're heading. It's just down through the little arcade here. Here we go. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. That's yeah. That's only more scary than the actual ghost hunting. <laughs> Cross here as well. So we're heading into this house. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's got it on his camera. Yeah.